war. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself, for my wife, for my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. He's right, you know. War never changes. Hi, this is Brandy, aka Pixelated War Twix. I know. Rude. Absolutely. <laughs> Let's start over. This is Brandy, aka Pixelated Twix. Welcome to my channel. If you're an OG, welcome back. This is the first episode of Fallout 4. Yes, guys. I started playing Fallout 4. I couldn't help myself. I really wanted to start playing this game again. I was in that mood. And you know what? When you have a YouTube channel and you start playing a game, you feel guilty about not capturing your gameplay. You just really do. So you honestly don't have any free time to just play whatever you want. Not that I'm complaining. I really want to share this or wanted to share this gameplay with you. Um, and I haven't planned to do it in the future. However... We're here today, so we're going to do it. Um, this is one of my all-time favorite games, and there's a lot of controversy behind this game because it is not your um, normal Fallout 4 or Fallout, I'm sorry, iteration. Why? Because it doesn't have the RPG aspects that um, past Fallout, Fallout games have or have. Um, this is more of a shooter, but it does have... Uh, some RPG. I enjoy it. I've played uh, this game. Uh, I've put a few hours into this game, to say the least. Um, and Bethesda just happens to be one of my favorite uh, gaming software companies. I know <laughs> they're um, not in everyone's good graces right now. I struggle too with that, just like I do with BioWare um, and sometimes Maxis. And I can name a few. Rockstar, hello. Um, but we all know that no one's fallible. People make mistakes and everybody should get a second chance. So I'm just waiting for Bethesda to make up for um, the failure of Fallout 76's release because I'm hearing great things about it right now. But um, whatever, I'm waiting for Starfield. But that's neither here nor there. We're not here to talk about what Bethesda is going to do. We're talking about what Bethesda did with Fallout 4. We're going to get started into character customization. Um, normally, I switch back and forth between playing Nate or Nora. 
I'm going to play Nora this time around. So we're going to go ahead and switch around. I won't do too much to Nate. I like Nate usually just how he is because I don't feel like dealing with a lot of customization for the guy unless I'm actually playing him. I will put a beard on his face though because I I like a little I like a little a uh, little more scruff than what he's got going on right now. But let's uh, figure out what we're gonna do with Nora. Actually, let's escape. I want to choose a base face um, to work with. Hmm. I mean, they all kind of look alike. This is a good look. I kind of like the freckles on her. Um, I actually like the other one. Oh, wait a minute. I How do I get back? Was that one? What was that? The redhead. I hope, I don't know what it is about me and redheads, um, but I, I love red hair for some reason. I think because my uncle, he had red hair, God rest his soul, um, and I was just, I just loved it. And he had freckles. I mean, I have freckles too. But he had red, head, red hair and freckles. Okay, so we're going to start with her. Um, I'm not going to make Nora a redhead, but I think we're going to go with um, something a little closer to brunette. But I do want to try to make her look like me, maybe. I don't know how close I'm going to get because, let's be honest, the character customization in this game is not that great. I mean, no... The options are great. It's just Bethesda's, they've never been good at this part of the game. This is why we needed mods in Skyrim to fix that. All right, so let's go and start sculpting. I want to make her chin. Um, oh, that's her neck. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what about her neck? Oh, okay, that, that's, okay, we don't want that. We want her neck a little bit. Like that. I swear, you haven't aged a day since our wedding. You're such, such a cutie. Thank you. All right. Got to have a guy that loves to compliment you, you know, every now and then. Too much and it, you know, it just gets annoying. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that works. And you got to compliment yourself, too. Like Nora's. Nora's uh, all about complimenting herself. Okay, let's see what we want to do with the cheeks. Um, can we puff them out a little bit? Raise them up. Okay. Absolutely lovely. I know. Um, let's work on these lips. Can we just fix the whole lip? Um, let's give her some some full nice. some full lips. I mean, I guess those are full. I suppose. What is this? A. Does this make it bigger? No, these make them smaller. So that's as full as we go, Bethesda. Let me show you what full lips are. Um, stop by, stop by my Twitter, and look at some of my pictures, and you will see what full lips look like. These are not full. I mean, they're 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 pouty, but they're not full. Um, okay, so let's make these a little bigger. I I uh, yeah, I like, I like it. I like it. Um, Actually, these are perfect. Perfection. Um, I like her nose, but let me see what other options we have. Chiseled. I do like the chiseled nose. I think we're going to go with the chiseled nose. But let's just look at pretty nose. I like the pretty nose, too. The pretty nose is not, like, perfect, but I like it. So we're going to go with that nose. And... Mm, um... I kind of like the eyebrows, but let's let's see what we can get. Oh, maybe these are a little more manicured. Um, I like the manicured. Okay, and let's work on the eyes. I think I want her eyes to be a little wider. Sean has my eyes. Maybe. Um, okay, we'll go with wide three, and then let's change her color. Actually, her color is kind of cool, the way it is, but I kind of want to go with the, hmm. Uh, 
those look, I don't know, dark gray maybe? Hmm. I like the light gray. The steel's really pretty. Oh, that, that looks weird. Um, okay, you know, let's stick with green. Let's let's keep it green. Um, can we fix her ears? Can we Okay, yeah. Um, average, mitch match. That looks a little that looks a little too. Lobless. As beautiful as the day we met. That's so weird. I've never seen lobeless ears before. Maybe I have, and I just haven't noticed. Let's go with average. Um, I'm not very good with this character customization, so you won't see a lot of changes. Um, but let's work on our hair. I do have a heavily modded game, just so you know. I have, like, over 90 mods um, from the Nexus, from Nexus um, alone. And then, of course, I've got some of the mods from the Creation Club. So, what do we want? Do you want titanium? Mm, actually, first, well, let's go with hair first, okay? And then we'll work on skin color. Oh, that's cute. Um, cliche. I kind of like cliche. Oh, that's really cute, too. I like that. That is super classy. I don't know, guys. All right. That's really cute. Um, hysteria. No, I'm not. I'm not really feeling hysteria. Candy bar is a bit much. Glare. No. Mm -mm. No. Uh, it's all right. No. <laughs> That's a definite no. Um, witness. No. Mm-mm. Actually, this is kind of cute. Um, huh. That's a look. Let's keep going. I like that. That's got like that 90s uh, mom vibe. Tinkerbell, Casanova, um, Ray. Hmm. That's actually really cute. Let me look at that. Oops. Let's keep going. Whoa. Wow. Okay. Um, mm -mm. I'm sorry, guys. This takes me a minute to get where I want to go. Um, Pinup's cute. Might be a bit too much. That's cute, too. I do like the beanie. Not going to lie. That's cute, too. What was that other one? The one, um, where was it? I don't remember the name of it. It's down here somewhere. Was it Kesa? I think it was Kesa. All right. I'm the best hairdresser. You do. I'm your hairdresser today, girl. Okay, so let's go with, oh, this is skin color. Okay, I meant to do hair color. So let's go with skin color then. And I kind of want to go with maybe, I guess, my skin complexion. Um, since I'm kind of playing as myself a little bit, I mean, I'm more like that, but I'm feeling chestnut. So Every we're going to go with chestnut. Um, I want to work in hair color. So let's go with, I like brown, dark brown, deep brown. Um... What about the chestnut brown? Um, that's red, really? Light brown, dirty blonde? No, let's go with chestnut brown. I like I it. it. Let's work on this makeup. Seriously. Um, let's get out of here and go to extras, I think, yeah. Makeup, um, I need to get rid of this hair, this, um, lipstick, and I want to get rid of that, get rid of the eyeliner, eyeshadow, all that's going, because we need a clean palette. Um, so blush, I do want some blush, but I don't know if I like the color. Okay, that's a little more subtle, like it. Um, no lip liner. Lip gloss, yes. But I don't like that it's so shiny. So I'll bring that down a little bit. Um, 
this a little bit more. Okay. I mean, that basically looks like matte, but it has a little bit of a shine. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Um, I don't want any lipstick. Is, is there a lipstick color on now? Okay, no. Um, okay, I do want eyeliner. And I want some... No, wait. Yeah. Um, nothing crazy. No, nope, that's definitely out of the question. Uh, lower eye. Do I want anything in the lower? No. Okay, so eyeshadow. Um, this is subtle. Okay. Whoops, I keep doing that. Eyeshadow here and then lower. Okay, I like that. How about that? Oops. Um, can we change the color? Yeah, maybe not. Maybe not Blake. Maybe not Blake. Maybe not Blake. Um, let's see here. Nope. I mean, that's okay. I don't know. That's a little much. The brown's okay. All right, we're good. Um, and then blemishes. I want to work on these freckles. I do like the fre the freckles, um, but I kind of want to keep the forehead freckles down. Um, what are cheek blemishes? Is that what we're calling freckles? Sweetie, you look as beautiful as the day. Is that what that is? Cheek blemishes or the freckles? I don't remember. Okay, let's take all that out because I don't know what's going on here. Um, so let's get rid of the sun scorch and the splotches and, um, where are we at? Forehead blemishes. Where are the, um, wow guys, where, is it freckles? No, that's not freckles. Um, Okay. Markings? Is that what it is? Okay. Now I see. Wow. Okay. Middle. Ooh, that muggle a little. Um, upper? No, I like that. And let's give her a little. Oh, yeah. Oops. Yeah, make them a little more noticeable. What am I doing? Okay. Um, except, I feel like her lips could use a little more, um, of attention. Let's give her a little more lip gloss. Maybe we could give her some lipstick, but, nice. oops, but I don't want anything too out of pocket because I mean, these colors, no. Absolutely not. Okay. We're going to just go with that. So we're going to make these a, little, a, tad bit, a tad bit more shiny. Um, okay. Cool beans. I think we're good. I mean, she doesn't look too different than her original. Maybe work on that chin a little bit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, just this chin. Bring this up. A little bit okay and then accept mm, so pretty thank you um nose tip let's sculpt can we make it a little wider or what is this doing what is this doing it's bringing it out but it's not bringing it making it wide What is that doing? Sweetie, you like my nose, right? Girl, you should need to like your nose. Don't worry about what he thinks. Worry about what you think. Okay? All right. So we're going to switch over to him. And I'm going to see what, how do I feel about her? I don't like that hair. I think the hair is a bit much. I'm going to change her hair. Um, I want to, oh, wait, shoot. Markings? Nope. How do we change his face? His, um, beard. 
let's see. Here we go. Facial hair. Okay, what do we got? No, absolutely not. Mm, that's kind of kind of like the goatee. It's kind of nice too. Um, but I do like that the lone wanderer look. What else we got? Um, I'm not feeling any of these. Don't like the chops. Not really. Looking like Abraham Lincoln. Nope. Absolutely not. Let's go back to, uh, what was it? What was I broken? Ooh, wee, honey. Um, let's go with Lone Wanderer. Ooh, mustache. Very good. Yeah, I like it too. Um, now let's go with okay, come on. her, because I really want to fix her hair. And, let me see. There was one other one. Oops, oops. See, let's go. What was it? No. Was it this one? That yeah, nice. I think I like that one. For now, I'm hoping I can change this later. I don't remember. I think we can. Um, let me see what about her skin color. We need a little more skin colors in this game. I'll just accept it as is. Uh, thank you. <laughs> You're so sweet. Uh, let's uh, check our body. See what we see if we uh, like it. I mean, it. Uh, it looks weird, doesn't it? I think it's our pants. Um, I don't want her muscular, but I mean, oof. Flat as a pancake, but that's okay. Work it. Work it. Okay, we're good. I think we're done here. Yeah, I think we're done here. Record time. This normally takes me forever. So let's, uh, let's get going.